I knew that the AK-47 and other rifles are inaccurate at long range, but I wanted to see just how inaccurate they are at some common ranges found in-game. I also wanted formulas to predict at which ranges I can reliably score a headshot with the AK-47 and M4. I did the research and found the answers. I'm going to jump right into real game examples, but I'll explain my methods and formula after. At 750 units, the AK has 100% accuracy, but at 800 units, the AK's accuracy drops to 95%. This might sound pretty good, but remember that this means even with perfect aim at the relatively short range of pit to long doors, you'll miss a headshot 1 out of 20 times. At 1200 units, the distance from CAT to the corner of CT mid, the AK-47 has a 69% headshot accuracy, and the M4 has a 90% headshot accuracy. Already the AK is becoming pretty unreliable, but it's at the 1600 range that the AK will only land 50% of its shots on the head. This is about the distance from long doors to T-spawn, or the back of B-site to tunnels, and it only gets worse from there. 2,000 units is the range from pit to A ramp. Over the course of 3,000 shots, I confirmed that at that range, the AK-47 has a headshot accuracy of about 38% and the M4 of about 52%. This represents an absolute best case scenario for shooting while standing. Under typical circumstances, both players will be moving and it's unlikely to aim on the exact center of the head. This means that even in the perfect scenario, your chance of hitting a target at that distance with the AK-47 is hardly more than 1 in 3. In comparison, I tested the AWP under the same conditions and found 100% headshot accuracy. I also tested the SG-553 and also found 100% headshot accuracy while scoped. This wasn't a surprise as the SG-553 is very nearly as accurate as the AWP when scoped. And in case you're wondering, the AUG is even more accurate than the SG. At 3000 units, which is the distance from T-spawn to CT cross, the AK drops to 22% accuracy. At that distance, the Scout is only 57% accurate. Of course, the op can aim center of mass, so it lands a shot every time at this range. However, if you aim a bit to the side, you have a good chance of missing even a body shot. Alright, now I'm going to get into the math and my methods. For the AK-47 and M4, I went and recorded a few thousand shots to find the accuracy of the weapons at two different ranges. I used SV Show Impacts and SV Show Bullet Hits to confirm headshots. I used Host Time Scale to speed up the game, and used an Auto Hotkey script to fire individual shots at a consistent rate slow enough to allow the guns to fully recover between shots. I also used FOV CS Debug to guarantee I was aiming at the center of the head with every test. The possible places a shot can land may be represented as a cone coming from the player and extending to where he's aiming. The longer the distance, the greater the diameter of the cone, and thus worse precision. For the closer target, I needed to be far enough away that the radius of the firing cone was larger in both width and height than the target head. And for the farther target, I needed to be close enough to get enough hits and misses in each trial for my coefficient of variation to be sufficiently low for statistical significance checks against my later empirical testing of the formula. After doing some geometry to find a linear fit of the radius of the cone at each distance and converting it into area, we can invert that to find the percent accuracy at each range. Using these formulas, you can easily use the console command cl underscore show pos1 to measure the distances between common spots on popular maps. I did just that with the common locations I showed you earlier in Dust2 to test my formula empirically. As a result, I'm confident that my formulas will give an accurate estimation, give or take a few percentage points. In conclusion, it's safe to say that with this empirical evidence on hand, you can ask anyone using the AK-47 a simple question. You what, mate? You are one fucking cheeky cunt, mate. The SG-443 will bash your fucking head in, mate. Swear me, mom. Swear me fucking mom, fucking, fucking cheeky prick, fucking cheeky prick. And for the farther target, I needed to be close enough to get enough hits and misses in each trial for my coefficient of variation to be sufficiently low for statistical significance checks against my later empirical testing of the formula. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs>